Hello and welcome to the payout, I guess that's the word, for the uh, Monday video, or the Wednesday video on GeoGuessr where I had to either get 50% above or below, I ended up getting below, game related, so it's this. Um, is it always going to be magic? No. But it just happened that this was something I was thinking about doing. Um, and since I lost, it was just a perfect tie-in, so... What am I doing? I'm doing a... I like, when I play this game, I try to do it like... Non-long, long, drawn out uh, matches. So I try to figure out what's the fastest way to potentially win a game. And I've done it in two turns. Granted, that's because somebody quit because I was going to win on turn three, but that still counts, I guess. This isn't game breaking or new to anybody really honestly it's just i came up with it i'm like i'm sure if i've thought of it many other people have there's probably way better things i can put into this deck than what i've got uh, it's essentially you want to put your little fire blade charger in because uh he gets haste whenever he's equipped with a weapon if he dies he does however much damage he had and what he, what what's he going to be ideally equipped with is a giant ass hammer uh, but you see here, it's cast one to actually cast it, and it ca casts eight to actually equip it. That's a lot. We can't live that long, so how do we get around it? By doing Resolute Strike, where it's an instant, one cost, you give it two, two, and you put it on whatever character you want to, which ideally it's turn one, it's either this guy, it's probably usually turn one, put the hammer down, turn two, charger resolute strike put this on them and then hit them and then you just wait to see what they say in return <clears throat> uh past that if for some reason you don't get it it's more of a double strike to quit war it's basically like sword warriors and weapons basically this person gives double strike i only put this shelter in kind of for a lane and also if somebody tries to target a creature i can Maybe potentially save it. I don't know. This is kind of a waste of two cards, I think. Next is another little guy who benefits from having equipment put on him. This guy for more of like control, telling who attacks what and whatnot. Force Master is just uh, in case someone's equipped and they die. <clears throat> Whenever a non token, you put it back in their hand. It's a lot of like if you end up killing this. Okay, I just put it back in my hand next turn. I can either equip it with that or uh, give it the weapon for this. Um, what else we got? This for anybody flying, mainly, since this is all land, to counter whoever's attacking or blocking. Nahiri in here, in case I put the weapons down, then I have nothing to equip it to. This person lets me create a little weenie, and then I can attach the hammer to it and then go from there. What else we got? Uh, it's all just super quick. You want to win fast. And that's what I'm hoping to do. So let us see how badly I do. Probably very. It's either super sink or swim. And by sink, it's it's usually a explosion. So ideally, you play this. And like people who play those super long out drawn games this beats that super quick will i actually be able to show off the combo mm, i don't know there's flings in there too it's like a fling land yeah this see uh i can also fling to end things if i wanted to this is bad we're gonna mulligan all right so we've almost got everything we need uh we're gonna put the fury away and right off the bat i think I'll put the hammer. All right. See what we're up against. Okay. We will put Weenie down. Weenie will probably get killed. This looks probably to be the uh, sacrifice deck, if I had to guess. Yeah, probably. So what I really need... I'm not getting, unfortunately. So we'll just put this down and then 
no attacks because now we're probably going to get the uh, Priest of the Old Gods. Or Scourge Diva, even worse. No blocks. I'm all in. To get this creature in, we'll attack. So now I've got control. This can continuously be recasted over and over again. Will it though? Uh, we'll see. That's fine. So block you. Scourge Diva's dead. Now it's back in my hand. The cycle continues. All right. Okay, we've got it now. I think I might have just won. We'll see what they end up casting. If it's that... Okay, he didn't. And now we attack. Hit you in the face. And if they kill him, he's going to do 13 damage to somebody. So the only thing they can potentially do is exile it. And now you're dead. And I win. That's how it goes. Uh, I've had this deck. I fought this deck once, like months ago. And I thought it was cool, and I just kept it in the back of my mind. I was like, oh, that's cool. Uh, this is a weird le legendary I've seen before, and I have no idea how to make it work. And a lot of the time I'll see unused legendary cards. I'm like, how can I build something around that? Honestly, blue decks and their, uh, what's the word? Blue decks and their equivalents. Most of the time I don't understand. They're usually a lot of controls. Can't I can't do that. I mean, I'll do rogues just because that's super fast. I should actually fully commit to maybe one of these times actually doing a uh, controller's deck, but I, I don't want to. And this is too slow. No mulligan. This is bad. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep it, get rid of a God of Battle, put in the Sejiri Shelter as a tapped white. Just get it out of the way. Um, we're behind the eight ball. Badly. So this seems to be a life gain deck of sorts. That's fine. <clears throat> I'm going to keep Sigrid. Let's see what they end up putting down. They might do the feedback loop thing, which would be unfortunate. Oh, that's fine. I am totally okay with that. See, you waste your one spell. You can only cast one thing a turn. There we go. Now it's my turn. Cargan War Leader goes down. Cast your one spell. <clears throat> I mean, that's totally fine and now we just hit you in the face a bunch yeah we'll play a hammer play your one spell gonna kill this one we'll just respawn and put it back in my hand you do not all right I'll just keep hitting you in the face Yeah, I'll put another hammer down. Why not? Go ahead. What's next? I think you're hoping for a... potential... board clear, probably, is my guess. You need one more land to do the Kaya's Wrath. I mean, why do you keep playing Rule of Law? It, does, it, it, it doesn't matter. I mean, until you beat me, I've got 
You know what? Fine, I'll play that. Go ahead, wipe the board. Thank you. I think they were waiting for that one land to uh, do Kaya's Wrath, if I had to guess. They couldn't get it. Uh, man, these growing pretty fast. But we'll just keep going. I mean, generally, these I do like maybe three matches. Four matches, depending on how quick they go. I mean, usually at this point, my deck is lost twice in a row. And, like, alright, I just want to see the, 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 the whole point of the deck actually go off. But, this hasn't been a problem yet. Thankfully. Uh, I mean, I haven't seen it play out perfectly yet. But we got there eventually. Uh, so yeah, we'll keep this. We're eight card away from actually... Well, two cards away. I think next turn I will do probably God of Battle. No reason not to. I'll just do the loop. Uh, they don't play anything this turn. Potentially the they could kill the charge before I get anything off. That's fine. They don't. All right. The loop begins. And now we just hit you in the face a bunch. Depending on what you put down next, I'll probably do Corp Blade Master. Oh, we're a gate deck. And now it's back in my hand. And I will hit you in the face for three. Back in my hand. Here we go. And then we hit you in the face. I probably should have put down the shelter so I could get Nahiri up next turn and then have a Colossus Hammer on a weenie. Yeah. There's the loop. Ah, uh, this is this this deck's great. I mean, it's not like going to win anything great, but it's cool when something not so much I thought of, but you don't see often being like, "Hey, this is working." I'm gonna do one more because again, it's only been twelve minutes. I mean, we're gonna horribly sputter out at one point here. We just haven't yet. Uh, very well could be this one. I'm being greedy. I'm going to keep this. Just hope I get it a land in time. Although this person's mulliganing a bunch. They're probably going to do one of those weird Thassa Oracle decks or the Rakdos, whatever it's called. I have a feeling that's probably what's happening. Oh, it's elves. Hot take. Elves are justice. Or just goblins in a different color. This is fine. Alright, so have our no attacks. Let's see what you do. Oh, Coco. As it's so lovingly referred to as. This is fine. You go ahead and counter them all up. Um, we're going to do this first. And, uh, we're going to hold off. This is fine. Resolve. Resolve. Go ahead. What are you going to do? Another Arch Druid? Fine. Resolve. Go ahead, attack. I want you. I don't think you understand what's about to happen. And now it's dead. Now it's my turn. Back up. And put you back on. No attacks. The loop is complete. Alright, we're not getting any lands, which suck. Uh, so you know what? We're just 
gonna attack. He's got vigilance. No reason to uh, not cast it. And now, let's see. Yeah, I've got. I got. I got no reason to not play anything. You gonna do another Coco? Allosaurus Shepherd, huh? That's fine. I'm probably dead. That's 14. Well, I can Resolute Strike. And, let's see. 21. I think I'm dead regardless, unless I stop one of these. So it's 7, 14. No, I'm... Oh, he's got exactly lethal. But I'll... Actually, no, it's not lethal. Well, it is lethal. I'm just dumb. So we'll do this. Put it on you. There we go. Nice. I hate elves. Just as much as I do the goblin decks. But yeah. That's the basic gist of this deck. Again, these have been fast. I'm going to do another one. Why not? Why not indeed? Although this one's taken a while. This one may... Oh, no, we got it. We're against Izzy I Sigil. Is Igil. Uh, no. Okay. We'll keep this. Havlar, go down. Play this. Play you. So if this dies before any... Okay, it didn't. Although, unfortunately, it might die now because they'll probably read this and be like, oh shit. <clears throat> this is bad. He's reading it now. Probably should get rid of the fire. If they if they get rid of the charger now. Oh, waste not. Interesting. Alright. For a discard deck. Man after my own heart. Go ahead. No discards, huh? Alright, fine. Let's see. I mean, I should just empty my hand. But we're not. So, let's see. Two. That's five. Seven. Nope. You do have something. And you're holding out on it for some reason. Exile creature, huh? You are... Actually, I think exile, I still get it. No, I don't. Okay. I thought if it dies or gets put in exile, I still get it. Clearly, I don't. Here comes the counters. And here it is, back again. So we found the control deck that is uh, going to kill me. What a weird, weird deck. Uh, do I want to keep it? I do. I think I'm dead anyway here. I've not actually fought this tech before. 
Ah. Well, now I have nothing in my hand. Uh, so we are not going to do anything because you're going to exile regardless. I think I can switch. Oh, this is the weird thing. Bam. Cancel. It's, it's making me do this regardless. I hate that little bug. So here comes the exile. No, not. Uh, I'll lose three life. Let's see. Yeah, we'll do this. And take action. Uh, there's literally nothing I can do. So... Target a creature you control. Yeah. I think we'll do this. Take action. You attack. That's fine. End turn. Untap the lantern. That's fine. I'll take three damage. That's fine. Lose three life. So, I know he's got Vraska's Contempt. Lose three life. We'll do this. Yep. Take action. All right, Cargan Intimidator. You have to get rid of this, otherwise I win. There we go. Got rid of the counter. Next. We'll do this. Yep, yep. Oh, this is so finicky, I hate it. Take action. Uh, everyone attack. Yeah, you gotta block it. End turn. So, that's removal. It's coming now. Lose three life. Keep doing it. Lose three life. Thank you. Uh, never got your discard unless your waste knot has very limited ability, and I feel that if you you need to get it out as soon as possible, otherwise don't play it at all. It's usually what I do with my discard deck. If I don't get it soon enough, I just kind of ignore it. But there we go. I think I won every single game with this with this deck. Fun little thing. But yeah, that's going to do it for our Monday video. What's next Monday going to be? Depends on how badly I do Wednesday. Thank you all for watching. I will see you next time. Goodbye.